Dear viewers, I hope you are all fine. This ultrasound video shows a case of endometrial hyperplasia. The patient is aged about 35 years and have three children. On pelvic ultrasound, endometrial hyperplasia is characterized by homogeneous increase in the endometrial thickness in the majority of the patients. However, endometrial hyperplasia may also cause asymmetrical or focal thickening with surface irregularity which should raise a suspicion for malignancy. Now you can see the endometrium thickness, endometrial thickness is increased. This is the endometrium. Biopsy of the uterine lining is the definite test for the diagnosis of hyperplasia. Women with abnormal bleeding should be evaluated with the pelvic ultrasound. You can see the endometrial thickness is about 19 millimeter in the transverse section. Now you can see the both the ovaries, uterus and the increased endometrial thickness is obvious. In postmenopausal women, the ultrasound is used to assess the thickness of the lining. Endometrial hyperplasia is a histological diagnosis often made after sampling the endometrium that appears thickened on pelvic ultrasound. It is defined as irregular proliferation of endometrial glands with an increased ratio of gland to stoma. The symptoms of the endometrial hyperplasia include abnormal vaginal bleeding, including bleeding, bleeding or spotting between menstrual periods, dramatic change in the duration of menstrual periods, postmenopausal bleeding or heavier menstrual blood flow. In some instances, endometrial hyperplasia may precede cancer of the uterus. Now the normal value of endometrial thickness is during periods it is 2 to 4 mm. Early proliferative phase it is about 5 to 7 mm. Late proliferative phase it is up to 11 mm. And in the secretory phase it is up to the 16 mm. In this case the endometrial thickness is about 19 mm. So Obviously, it is increased and the patient may be suffering from endometrial hyperplasia. Now, this is a condition where the female reproductive system, the lining of the uterus, that is endometrium, becomes unusually thick because of having too many cells, that is hyperplasia. It is not cancer, but in certain women, it raises the risk of developing endometrial cancer, a type of uterine cancer. The thickness of the endometrium lining is rarely over 4 mm. In postmenopause, the premenstrual woman, woman, the thickness varies from the phase of the menstrual cycle as I have already dis disclosed to, described. You can find some important information in the description of this video. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe my channel. If you do like this video, please click the like button. Thanks.